to understand your brand. A lot of people know the value of what I'm giving, so I had to monetize the value that I'm giving. You need to be transparent with what you do. It's not all about money. You need to be consistent with what you do. And to get to a point, someone will know your value with what you are doing. Let's learn how to travel. An average worry person is very, very comfortable in worry. If you want to love your city, but at the same time, you need to understand the culture of different people. I have traveled, I have seen, and I've brought back that, that thing I learned from where I went to, to worry. Let me an average worry person is Mr. Landlord, travel and see. So, thank you for your time. Thank you, Worry. Please don't forget to share this video. John Love, I'm very proud of you. If I see you again now, I'm not going to slap you. If I see you again, I'm not going to slap you again. I don't leave you. Since when me and you quarry, I go your page, I check your page. I see, say, you know, they post about gambling again. You know, they carry Igbo. You know, they post all those Igbo, Igbo, Igbo things. You know, you don't change. You don't reform. See you now. Advising and going to seminars and talking to young people. Encouraging them to get things done, lucrative things, to engage themselves in things that will profit them. You understand? Now, now you don't do the work of the SSC. I know we'll slap you again if I see you. I know we'll touch you. You don't really represent. You understand? Put your state in a good light. Open the minds of the youth. Nobody say you carry gambling. Come they advertise for the youths. They give them odd. Old man like you. By now, your family members will be proud. And I'm also proud of you, bro. I'm also proud of you. You understand? I'm also proud of you. Let me do what I said before. I get short 10 odds. There's nothing that is sure in gambling. I don't know if they deceive anybody. There's nothing sure in gambling. Say you want old Messi level, you want old Ronaldo level, me no score. Eh? And you want old goalkeeper, you want who? Nana, me or Nana, no do mistake for back. No, no. There's nothing sure, bro, in gambling. So it's high time that we start telling this youth that see, this gambling scene, now says that they take play on. Nigeria now, almost all the old influencers now gambling that they advertise give the youth. Meanwhile, most of them don't even play it. They don't even have time to play it. Go and check all your influencers. Do you think they have time to stake? Don't come, eh? This one bet. That one bet. That one bet. Use my promo code. Use my promo code. Use my promo code. That is basically what is everywhere in Nigeria now. Different betting company coming in. I'm not going to entirely blame the influencers. I'm also going to blame the government. Because what are they even doing for the youth? They've crippled the mentality and the mindset of the youth that they cannot be better. There's no option anywhere for them. So I don't even really blame them for going into gambling. But gambling is not the way. Do you understand? So Jolof, I am really happy for you. And like I said, if I see you, I'm not going to slap you again. Even though you leak my house address, you make me pack. Which you see they pay me. You understand? You see they pay me. Because I look down my house. I don't even need to go down my house. Go check some things. Or if like any time when one when anybody don't do like it's your now that house because that house get all the old juju get all the ugume you go sit down for there. So Jolof, I'm proud of you. Keep it up. Um, if to say you didn't hear me, I will touch you. I'll say, boy, you have really tried. You understand? I'm pretty sure every other person have um every other person is proud. Now mind you, let me tell you something. Jolof, you have really made a mistake, right? You made a lot of mistake in Delta State. You see, the first time I said if I see you, I will slap you. There's somebody, hmm? there's somebody that called me, very popular and very rich. Called me, said video, slap him. Anything where you want, I will give you. He's a very nonsense person. You understand? So this one is a medium to tell you, see, there's somebody that you need to go and apologize to. Go and apologize to that person. Mend your relationship with them. And if they give you opportunity to come close to them again, do you understand? Don't be the one say today you support APC, tomorrow you go support PDP. I understand that politics, you know, get permanent stay. But there are some godfathers and some people that you people have, because me and know you do godfather. There are some people that you people have, that you people are supposed to be loyal to because they gave you the platform. So, your love, reach out to those people, uh, to that person especially, and please kneel down, beg him, because he really show you love. You understand? But now, if I see you, like I said, this is just a video say, if I see your love, I'm not going to sand down again. I will leave her because it's only try. Don't be a good example to the youth. I like that, your love. Keep this up. Eh? Keep it up. Peace and love. Don't play. You have already learned, Sha, so I will not say you will learn the hard way. You don't already learn the hard way. Take care, eh? Do. Okay, butterfly.